Hey, what's up, Impact Wrestling fans? This is BQ. It's the Impact Lounge. Before I get to the original intent of this upload, I wanted to talk about WrestleCon. So I wish I could tell you where the source came from. I really don't know. It was just something that kind of got passed on. But it looks like the Impact and Lucha Underground event has the second highest gross ticket sales for reserved seating so far. And um, they're sold out for, for rows one and two. I've still got my second row ticket. Hopefully I can make it. And I want to say rows three and six are... Probably about 30, I shouldn't even say that. Um, they're like, they're, they're pretty close. I don't remember the number. They're pretty close to sold out. And then the um, fourth and fifth rows are the ones that they still got to, they got to fill a little bit. Those are only about halfway uh, full at the moment. But they've grossed $25,000 so far off the pre-sales. And that's um, ahead of CZW. Uh, Rev Pro, The Crash, and House of Hardcore. So looks like they're doing really good, and they've sold about 300 total seats so far. And you know these are smaller venues, and people have a lot of other options. And it's also during the Hall of Fame, so I think they're doing really good. And I think that thing will definitely sell out in due time. Which I, I want to say the sellout looks like it'll be about 400 or so, and maybe there'll be some standing room. I don't really know, but it looks like it's doing really, really well so far. So super excited about it. Also, the original intent of this upload, the Impact Lounge is now on Facebook. It was on Facebook before as King of the Mountain podcast. I wasn't able to dedicate much time to it because I had been trying to change it to the Impact Lounge for the longest time. Facebook would just kept denying me, would not allow me to do it. So there's a new page started from scratch. You can go to the description of this video and go directly to it. And there's a lot of interactive posts on there. The way that these inter the, well, the way that fan pages work on Facebook is when the admin posts, only about one to ten percent of the people see the posts. So, get in there and interact a little bit. Click on two or three posts that you like, and that's gonna excuse me. That's gonna ensure that you see future posts. And the more you know, in that initial one to ten percent, the more that engage, the more the rest of the page is likely to see it. So, you know, really help me out like the page, get on there, find one or two posts that you want to engage with. Even if you just want to hit like on a couple of them, you don't have to comment, but do something for me. And that's going to help us out quite a bit. There's about 120 likes on there so far. It's only about a week, week and a half old, but we're going to get it popping. So hopefully you like us on Facebook. And if you miss all the YouTube uploads, all the YouTube uploads are going to go on there too. So hopefully that helps you guys out. Also, if you're familiar with discord and you like, you know, chat rooms and things of that nature, uh, Discord's kind of what's hot, hot on the streets right now. So there is an Impact Lounge Discord. And whether it's Facebook or Discord, I do have other admins. So it's not always going to be me in there. But what I'm going to try to do during Impact, instead of doing a whole heck of a lot of live tweeting, is I'll be in the Discord chat room talking to you guys about what's going on and everything. So if you're interested in that um, and the Facebook, just hit the description of this video and you're going to find direct links for both of them. And don't forget, I'm on Twitter at BQ Speaks, and I'm now on Instagram at BQ Speaks. So those are uh, four ways to, to keep in touch with what's going on with the Impact Lounge, but definitely get involved with Facebook and Discord, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.